this time round, it's, it's all about the journey. Before when I've done it, I've always thought about that moment you cross the line. I'm showing my children what hard work is like and I'm showing them to dare to dream. And I think that that message, I think, is much more important for me this time round. I just wonder if, if I could do this. It didn't seem possible, but I think that's what intrigued me. My main challenge at the moment is just simply juggling motherhood and sleepless nights with trying to be the best rower I can be. I came up with a rule that I'll always put the children first and it means when I know they're happy that I know I also do my best job as a rower. I'm from Penzance, which is the southernmost point in the UK. It's pretty much Land's End and it's right on the coast. Cornwall's famous for fishing and farming and I've got to say ice cream because my dad was an ice cream man. Our family ice cream shop was in, was in the family for about 100 years and I grew up on good old Cornish ice cream. Now I'm here in Marlow, just down the road from our training centre in Reading. It was four years before London that I first got into a boat and I never, ever, ever could have dreamt of where that journey went. It's the person you're working for that gets you through those last two minutes and I want to cross that line for Polly. Every stroke you take, you're taking it for your teammate and I find her inspirational, aspirational and just a force of nature to race with. The human body is capable of the most incredible things. Juggling motherhood with being an elite athlete. Finding that inner gear when your body is telling you no. Never ever wanted to let your teammate down. Inspiring my children. Stroke after stroke, back and forth. All for the moment.